Where we find a, most of our innovation, and I will say most, it's, it's really true, is, is from our experts. Those are the athletes, the coaches, the trainers. And one really good example of that is one of our uh, prime coaches, Vin Lanana. We were talking to him about uh, why his athletes and why his teams are so successful. And he basically said, well, I think they're less injured. And when they're less injured, I can make them train harder and thus they go faster, they perform better. He had his athletes training out on the grass barefoot. Coach Lanana said, I can't prove this, but I believe that athletes that have been training barefoot on grass perform better and have fewer injuries. It's just common sense. We spent about a year and went through 12 prototypes doing all sorts of things to try and find a way to make footwear actually simulate the same motion, force, and pressure that we saw barefoot on grass. And that eventually became Nike Free. We really wanted to understand what was preventing the foot to perform or to mimic barefoot training in traditional shoes. And when we found out that it, was, it had a lot to do with the sole of the shoe, the midsole, the outsole, basically it was too rigid for those small intrinsic muscles of the foot in order for them to go through their full range of motion. It really allowed the foot then to be more in control of the shoe instead of the shoe being in control of the foot. Most coaches, trainers, orthopedists, and biomechanists would agree if you have a stronger, more flexible body, it does seem to make sense that you have less chance of injury and that you're going to perform better in whatever movement or sport that you're doing.